Sally playing pool in the games room. With Rob, oh. with Stuart, watching. Oh, it's me. I'm Stuart, yeah. No, I'm a joker's dad. <gasps> She's in. Yes! yes! Like a monkey! Hey, cool. Hello. He's like a joker's dad. Hmm? Wow! Yeah. Right. Stuart, I'm going to have a serious conversation with you. So.
There are some who say that this steam train is a little old-fashioned, but for me, it's the only way to travel. Of course, there are those who prefer to hit the highway, and on the right, you just might spot some pint-sized drivers taking their first spin behind the wheel of a car. Getting from place to place is a big deal in Tomorrowland, where you might board a people mover, zip around on the Astro Orbiter, or book a flight across the galaxy at our busy starport in Space Mountain. Tomorrowland is truly a world on the move. Speaking of moving, it seems like a whole lot of new neighbors have been migrating in from all corners of the Milky Way. Now there's that rascally experiment 626, better known as Stitch. Always up to his usual. Even the monsters of Monstropolis have taken a shine to Tomorrowland. I hear those monsters are pretty funny. They're sure funny looking. Yeah, the future is here today at the Magic Kingdom. And the future looks like a lot of fun. But after working on the railroad all the live long day, it's nice to come home to good old Main Street, USA. Inspired by he's made a complete trip around the Magic Kingdom. For those of you who've been on board for the whole journey, well, thanks for putting up with me these past few days. If you're staying with us, we'll be headed for Frontierland next. Right now, please stay seated until our train comes to a complete stop. Then pick up your belongings and carefully step off the train. If you have strollers to unfold, please take them all the way beyond the platform. Magic carpets, 
when you visit Adventureland, bring an extra dose of bravery. As for me, I'll stay safe and sound right here aboard my train. decided to put down stakes and live here too. Of course, those early settlers weren't the first to make their home in this wild frontier. These native tribes of Plains Indians were living, hunting, and trading for centuries before we ever came along. They were the first to tame the wild horses of the American plains, long before our big old lion horses started chugging through these parts. Thank you. 